it has elements of some of the old stuff, which I really like, because that's something that Hecate kind of lost a bit towards the Red Emissary stuff. But it doesn't lose that either. It's kind of, it's a nice blending of everything, and it's all nicely put together. Now they've done the digital. They're not, they're not, they're not changed. They're still old school. They're still the same plays, but you can see they're a lot more conscious of what they're doing. And I think that's going to come across in the new live shows. I think you're going to see a lot more of a tighter. You're not going to lose the feel. It's not going to lose any of its um, buzz and, 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 and darkness or anything like that from it. It's the same band, but it's kind of punchier, tighter, and uh, toned more. And that's definitely because of the recording process these guys have been through. I think there's definitely themes to each song, and you know it represents what we do. As regards to the new album, it's 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 worked really well. I mean, the songs were written. I mean, Gareth's come in. He's put his drums down to it. You know, he's it, it's he's, it's in his style, but it's it's completely in fitting with it. As a matter of fact, it's it's given a bit more life to the tracks, I think, and it's this sounding really good. Elliot's done the same. I mean, his vocal range is superb. His um, you know, his high range is 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 he's a very traditional black metal vocalist, but at the same time, his death metal growls are absolutely superb. We haven't had to change a thing. He's come straight in. He's re-recorded these songs, and, and, and they sound superb. They sound as they should be. So it's been very rewarding and a lot of fun. I'm pretty proud of some of the things that we've, we've written. It was, it was difficult um, for me. Um, as before, when we've uh, recorded uh, organically, you've got the power of the amps behind you. You, you feel the song. Um, you feel all the power there. You, you know, all the energies, everything, all the levels are right. And you kind of play, you know, to your best ability, sort of thing. And the biggest difference with that was obviously doing it digital. You are sat in front of a desk, in front of a computer, basically, um, and that feeling's not there. So you have to dig a lot deeper into yourself and um, drag that song up. So how you imagine it in your head to finish, you know, to sound on the album, you have to have that firmly. Play, you know, placed in your head to try and get that feel, get the energy for it, and to play it to your best ability. Um, that was a big shot trying to do that, but um, we pulled it off. I hope. I mean, everyone's going to say, yeah, this is going to be the best release we've ever done. This, that, and the other. But honestly, hand on heart, it is. <laughs> it's uh, it's a nice blend of the older style, like Slaughter, Requiems, mixed in with a bit of maybe Kings of Chaos, and there's something extra in there as well. Yeah.